Wow, Merry Christmas. I can't believe another whole year has gone by. Yeah, exactly. Merry Christmas, not Happy Holidays. And three presents. It's very generous of you. Thank you very much. And... Is this empty? Yeah, it's empty. It's there as a lesson to remind you of the emptiness of our future in a post-apocalyptic wasteland. Oh. You're welcome. Okay, well, that, that's pretty clever, I guess. Uh, let's see what's in number two. Number two is definitely not empty. This one's got some weight to it. Let's see what's in there. It's a... Uh, ah! What is... What, what's in here? It's, it's, it's wet and, and furry. It's a dead rat. A gift to acclimate you to the type of diet you'll be eating when the shit hits the fan. My only regret is I wasn't able to make it radioactive. Oh. Um, okay, well, that, that must have been difficult to procure. Uh, thank you very much for that. Uh, let's, see, let's see what's in number, number three. Sometimes big things come in small packages, right? Let's, uh, let's see what we got in here. The note. See, uh, maybe it's a, a treasure map to the real present. Let's see. It, it says I'll kill you? Yes, it does. This last gift is a reminder of the bleak future we all face when everything and everyone wants to kill us. Prepare to defend yourself! <laughs> Set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want and I always give it 100. Don't need a bank, no, I'm funded. Play the game like it's nothing. I'm always thankful for something. Don't take for granted, stay humble. Now, waiting, better believe in your mind, cause it's everything. You can mold, shape, find almost anything. Hey everybody, this is Praxis. Four years ago, I designed what I felt was the ideal prepping gift for kids. That is the bug out card game. It's a family card game that makes the idea of preparedness fun and entertaining, and it's a game that the whole family can all enjoy together. As soon as I finished it, I was so excited to have completed the project. I pretty much just put it down and I never really shared it with you guys at all for the past several years. And I wanted to rectify that in this video and I wanted to mention it. Uh, if this is something that you think might be helpful for anyone in your family, uh, children that you would like to introduce to prepping and preparedness in a way that is not at all frightening, but instead is enjoyable and challenging and thought provoking, this might be a great way to do it. I designed all the cards myself. The game is based around the game that I used to like when I was a kid. It's called Millborns. That was a racing car game where you had to avoid uh, certain pitfalls and prepare for those pitfalls. And I adapted that style of play to the idea of a bug out bag where you want to have certain things in your bug out bag. And if you get hit up with certain pitfalls along the way, it pays to have your preps in your bag. So it's a fun game for the whole family. And again, it just introduces uh, kids in particular to the idea of prepping and preparedness in a way that is enjoyable and entertaining. At the end of this video, I'm gonna share with you the promotional video that I used for the Kickstarter campaign to get that project done. You'll see in that video, I'm talking about it as though this is a project in the future. At this point, it has been done. It's been done for four years, but it gives you a good idea of the gameplay and what I was uh, trying to achieve with that project. And I think it successfully achieved. I'm really proud of how it came out. And at this point, the next step really, honestly, is just to get it in people's hands so that people can benefit from all the work that I put into it. If if this is something that you'd like for anyone in your family, it's being sold in one place and one place only online. Uh, the major fundraiser, uh, the person that really financially made the whole thing come together, he's selling it on his website and I'm going to put a link down in the description below to his website so you can order it. In fact, on every single video that I ever release, you can look down in the description below and there's always a link to the bug out card game in his website. I'm not exactly sure when uh, would be the cutoff date for ordering it. Sooner will be better to get it ahead of the holidays if you want to give it as a gift. I'll put a graphic up on this screen if I'm able to hear back from him what he thinks his cutoff date would be for the continental the United States anyway. But if you guys would like to you know, get that for anyone on your list, sooner would obviously be better. The other thing I wanted to bring up with you guys in this video is something kind of completely unrelated to prepping, but it's something I made for my sister. <laughs> she likes Christmas, she likes Halloween, and uh, her kids are the same way. And I made this little coloring book for them. It's called Creepy Christmas. 
I was getting it printed up at the printer and I realized that they make a really easy option for me to offer it out to other people. So if you would like to order a copy of this book yourself, if you have a similar weird family, <laughs> we all like Christmas and Halloween at the same time. It's got 22 pages of weird Halloween Christmas themed, uh, you know, different uh, scenes where you've got like, uh, there's a vampire here in front of a Christmas tree and then you get Santa Claus with a bunch of jack-o'-lanterns and pumpkins. There's werewolves here, there's witches, uh, you know, there's all just sort, sorts of different weird Halloween stuff. So I figured I'd mention this since I'm doing a video about different things that people might want to get for Halloween. It has nothing to do with prepping and preparedness, but it's a fun little thing. And it was really inexpensive. That was the thing I was really uh, blown away by, uh, by the printer, is that they're able to offer this for a really low price. Uh, I think it was just, it was a few dollars for shipping and handling, and at, like I think like six dollars in order to or, order your own copy. So if you're interested in the coloring book or the card game for kids, the links are all down in the description below. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Hey everybody, this is Praxis. One of the primary driving missions of my preparedness channel has always been to try to help people by sharing knowledge and experience. I feel this way about people at large that I don't even know that I've never met, but even more so for my family, where I'm always trying to help keep them safe to protect them, and beyond that, to try to teach them to protect themselves. As a dad, I'm always looking for opportunities to share my knowledge about preparedness with my boy, and I do that in a number of ways. You know, as simple as just when a topic comes up, discussing it with him, we'll go hiking, we'll go camping. When it comes to preparedness, I always try to explain to my boy what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. But whatever the approach is to sharing these lessons, I've always found that they work better and he pays attention more if it's fun and it's engaging. I try to do that with my YouTube channel as well. I try to keep things funny and I try to keep them light. What are the kids today calling it up? Uh, splitting the wood. No one calls splitting it that the wood, anymore, I Dad. I did that with the Alien Invasion series with the science fiction element and trying to keep it interesting and dramatic. That's not a good sound. I'm just gonna move out of it. Okay, we'll do this later. Flipping that off. Holy shit. And now I'm doing it again with a new card game that I'm calling Bug Out. Bug Out is a fun way to share ideas related to emergency preparedness and wilderness survival skills with your family and especially with the kids in your life. The entire structure of the gameplay fosters values such as preparing for hazards, saving up for the future, balancing potential risks, and striving past obstacles. And in addition to this, almost every card in the deck has its own unique preparedness or survival tip related to what's going on in the game. I also designed the game to be super easy to learn and anyone can play it without having to learn a huge pile of intricate rules. And I took a lot of time with the artwork to make the cards look great and grab kids' attention. Essentially, play breaks down into the mindset that there's been an emergency situation, there are problems, and there are solutions, and your goal is to manage both of those things while you're pushing forward towards success. That's a lesson that's useful in an emergency situation, but also just in normal day-to-day -day life. If a game like this sounds like something that you might be interested in giving to your kid, grandkid, or anyone in your life that you think would benefit from a little extra prepper mindset, then here's how you can help to make this into a reality and be able to share that gift with whomever you had in mind. And that's it. The links are below. Thanks for watching. Hey YouTube preppers, if you enjoyed this video, here's another one that I think you might like. But before you click on it, I wanted to take a moment to thank all the people on the right hand side of your screen. They help to support all the work that I do here over at Patreon.com. If you'd like to join them and get your name added to the list, the link's below.